Hi everyone, in this problem we're being asked to find the equation of a parabola and we're given the vertex, the focus, and we're told it's symmetric to x equals 7. So whenever you have a problem where you're being asked to find an equation uh, for a parabola and you're given information, um, I think one way to do it is to plot what you have and then from that you should be able to come up with the answer. So here's the y-axis and here is the x-axis. So x and y. And let's go ahead and plot what we have. So we have that the focus is 7 comma 5. So I'll say maybe that's here, 7 comma 5. I'm just going to say it's there. And then 7 comma 3, actually 7 comma 3 is below it. So what I'll do is this. I'll, I'll put the 7 comma 5 here. There we go. I just want to have enough room for my, for my 7 comma 3, which is here. All right, so we have our vertex, which is 7, 3, and our focus, which is uh, 7, 5. And we're told it's symmetric to x equals 7, so that means that uh, x equals 7 passes right through the middle of the parabola. So this is the vertex, and because it opens towards the focus, it's going to look like this. So that's actually the graph of our parabola. So now we can actually find the equation. Um, the equation for a parabola that opens up or down has the x being squared. So in this case, it opens up, so our x is being squared. That equation is x minus h, parentheses squared, equals 4c times y minus k. We have our h and k, that's our vertex. So h is 7, and then k is 3. So this will be x minus 7, parentheses squared, equals and then 4c, and then y minus k, so y minus 3. All right, and we just have to find c. So because it opens up, c is positive, and the distance between the focus and the vertex is always equal to the absolute value of c. So the distance between 3 and 5 is just 2. And so because c is positive, it must be 2. So we have x minus 7 squared equals 4 times 2 and then we have our y minus 3. Good stuff. So this will be x minus 7 squared and then 4 times 2 is 8 and then we have our y minus 3. And that will be the equation of the parabola.